Let's answer her post about word problems. Number one, a dozen eggs cost 63 pesos. How much do seven eggs cost? Dito mayroon na siyang answer na letter B. Ngayon, ang gagawin natin ay yung solusyon paano naging letter B. 63, i-divide natin yan ng 12. Ito. So, 63 divided by 12 para malaman natin kung uh, magkano ang tig-isang egg. So, this is 63. Tapos, ang decimal dyan, this is 2, 24, 6, 5. So, ang kada isa ay 5.25. Itong 5.25, i-multiply natin yan ng 7. Kasi ang tanong, how much do 7 eggs cost? 5.25 times 7. So, the answer is 36.75. Number two, the sum of two integers is 63. If one of the integers is three more than twice the other, what are the two integers? Let n be that, yung isang integer, plus, summon, so plus, one of the integers is three more, three more. Ito yung ibig sabihin ng three more. Three more than twice The other integer, so twice, 2 times n. Ito yung isang in integers natin. So, ito na yung equation. Equals 63. So, ito na yung kabuuhan ng equation. Solve natin yung mga like signs. n plus 2n, that is 3n plus 3 equals 63. Mag-transpose tayo. Maging minus 3, minus 3 to both sides. So, wala na dyan. 3n na dito. 63 minus 3, that is 60. Ngayon, i-divide natin ang both sides ng 3 para ma-isolate si n dito. So, 60 divided by 3 equals 20. Yung isang integer ay 20. So, itong isang n, 20. 3 plus 2 times 20. Balito 40, 40 plus 3 equals 43. So, ang mga numbers ay 43 at saka 20. This is uh, 43 plus 20, this is 63. So, ito yung mga numbers. Letter C, 43 and 20. Number 3, Mr. Gilbates owned 3-8 of Macrohand after selling one-third of his share. How much macrohan does Mr. Gilbates still own? 3.8 yung sa kanya. I-divide natin ng 3. Or, pariho lang yan. I-multiply natin ng 1 third. Doon tayo sa divide para mas klaro lang. I-divide natin kasi yung 1 third lang. So, bali, ihatiin natin ng tatlo itong 3.8. Divide natin ng 3. Kung mag-divide tayo ng 3, Uh, division maging multiplication, C3 maging one-third, pariho lang. Kung minumultiply natin agad-agad. 3 times 1 equals 3. 8 times 3 equals 24. Tapos, ito yung equivalent ng one-third. So, kung one-third lang ang bininta, so mayroon pa siyang two-third. Ito yung equivalent ng one-third. I-multiply natin ang 2 kasi yun na yung natira sa kanya. And this is 6 over 24. I-list natin yung 6 over 24 and greatest common factor niya ay 6. So, that is 1 fourth. The answer is letter E. Hulitin ko para mas lalong maintindihan lang. Itong 3, 8, ito yung uh, pagmamayari ni Gil Bates. Yung 3, 8. 1 third nito, hatiin natin ng tatlo itong 3, 8. So, ito hinatin na natin. Bale, kung maghati tayo ng fraction divided by 3, kopyahin lang ito, ang division maging multiplication, tapos yung 3 maging reciprocal niya ay 1 third. So, ganito lang din. 3 times 1 equals 3. 8 times uh, 3 equals 24. Itong 3 over 24, equivalent yan ng 1 third. 
ito yung binenta niya. So, mayroon pa siyang two-third na natira. Kung ito ang equivalent ng one-third, it times two, dalawang ganito ang meron ang natira sa kanya. So, times two natin yan. Dalawang ganito or kahit ganito na, para mas klaro lang. Bali, 3 and 24 plus 3 and 24. Dalawang one-third na lang natira kasi isang one-third uh, binenta niya. And this is equal to 6 over 24. Ang 6 over 24 ni least lang natin. Ang greatest common factor niya ay 6. So, 6 divided by 6 is 1. 24 divided by 6 is 4. So, ang answer dito ay 1 fourth. Number 4. Si Mr. Ratzinger, ang hirap naman ang pangalan niya, was able to purchase a digital camera set that was, uh, that would cost him 17800 This amount represents the down payment and 6-month installment of 1800 How much is his down payment? 6 months installment daw ito, 1800 So, i-multiply natin si 1800 ng 6. So, this is, tapos i-bring down natin yung dalawang 0, 10800 So, i-minus natin si 10800 dito sa kabuuhang pr price. So, 7,000 ang dinadown niya. Letter B. Number 5. Mr. Gadi and Mr. Manuel together have 200,000 pesos. If Mr. Gadi has 120,000, how much more money does he have than Mr. Manuel? Silang dal dalawa, mayroon silang 200,000. Yung isa, Mayroong 120,000. I-minus natin yan. So, ang natira, yan yung kay Manuel. Ito naman ay kay Gadi. Kasi sa given, si Mr. Gadi and Mr. Manuel together, mayroon silang 200,000 together. Ba silang dalawa. Yung isa naman, 120. So, i-minus natin yan. Yan na yung kay Manuel. Ang tanong is, how much money does he have done Manuel. So, i-minus mo lang din itong 80,000. Kung ilan ba? 40,000. So, lamang ang isa ng 40,000. So, the answer is letter D.